I want you for a minute though to just pause that line of thinking. I want you to kind of step back a little bit and just maybe listen to someone who's closer to your older brother. And let me share a couple of things with you. For those of us who have kids, uh, we know how much responsibility it really is. So life lesson number one, for the love of God, do not have kids until you're ready. And you're never ready. So bottom line, don't have kids. <laughs> no, I mean, and look, I love kids and I love my kids. My kids are probably the greatest thing that ever happened to me. So you have to think about it and you have to be ready. And you're never gonna be ready and that's okay, but you have to really think about it. And that's what's important, the, the number one takeaway. So that means that you can't do certain activities without certain other things. Kids are the most amazing thing in the world and they take an incredible amount of time and effort and energy. So we just celebrated Mother's Day. I hope you all greeted your mom. Happy Mother's Day. We're going into Father's Day season very soon. So prepare now and think about your dad. You'll never fully understand what they did for you until you become a parent yourself. And only then will you realize Wow, you poop a lot. Wow, you cry a lot. Amara's only 10 months, and, and I've, we're in like the tens of thousands of diapers. And night, a night's sleep still does not exist in my house. Like, she wakes up every night, and luckily my wife deals with it more than I do. But kids also teach you something. And I hope that there's some way that you could learn this because it's really, really important. We only have a little bit of time on this planet, but every day. And because kids require so much, you really have just a little bit of time. Like I used to, you know, be able to stay up till 3 a.m. and do things and, you know, like watch TV shows or do other things, work, stay up late. I mean, sometimes we played Dota in the office till like two or three in the morning. And it was fun and I loved it. I'm not saying don't have fun. But the reality is now, um, my family wakes up at about six in the morning. And I'm like the morning person. That's my role. So it doesn't matter what time I went to bed. I have to wake up because there's a baby crying and there's a little boy who wants his breakfast. And like the morning just starts. And so what I can tell you is you should really, really treat time as if it was all the money in the world. Because it is so precious and you have so little of it. And I know this sounds like very deep and very serious, but it's more from the perspective of you should be doing something that you love. Like every moment, you gotta take advantage of it. And if you're not happy, you gotta figure out what's going on and you gotta make adjustments in your life. Because if you're not really enjoying what you're doing right now, look, I love you, but I would rather you go somewhere else and be happy and enjoy it. But you have to be happy with what you're doing. But time in life is so powerful. I have about half the time in my life that I used to have. And man, I miss those old days. So, I challenge you guys right now, while you're still young, take advantage of it. Take advantage of the time that you have. Make the most of it. If there's something you wanna learn, or something you wanna do, or something you wanna read, man, by God, do it now. Because the moment you become a parent, there's one big shift. It's not about you anymore. It's about them. So it doesn't matter really what I want to learn anymore. It matters what am I gonna teach my children. The question fundamentally changes when you have children. You have time, and that is the biggest asset that you will ever have in this world. So take advantage of it. If you wanna learn something here at SEMP, take advantage of it. You have a lot of smart people. Some are parents, some aren't parents. It doesn't matter what they want. They're very smart, and you can learn something from them. So work on that. Take advantage of your time. For you guys who are even younger, you're still in college, you're like, what is this? Man, just learn. Just keep learning. Never stop learning. There's so much information. Use your time wisely. You have the internet. It's one of the, the most amazing things in this world. 
So use it. So a few takeaways. Number one, don't have kids until you're ready. Number two, you'll never be ready, so don't have kids. <laughs> Number three, when you have kids, your life will change. Number four, it's for the better because it will make you a better steward of your time. And so number five, to those of you who don't have to be a better steward of your time, act like you have kids. And so if there is one thing that parenting will teach you um, the hard way, is that you have to figure things out. So I challenge you guys to really take that perspective to heart. Figure things out and use your time wisely.